So here in this drop down, I can choose from any of the available territories to create my heat map. So I'm just going to search by typing in US states. Then I'll click there. Okay, and then I'm going to take the fill color and I'm going to change it from random colors to dynamic heat map colors. Okay, once I've done this, this is where it's important that you have a data set uploaded to your account because you're going to need to select it. So here in the list, I'm going to type in sales so I can get my sales data. So I'll click there. So now you have two different options for how to create this heat map. The first one is using location density, which would obviously make territories that have a high number of pins red or hot and a low number of pins cold or green. The other option you have is to color the territories based on the values of the data set that you uploaded. So we're going to use this one, so we'll click here on data set values, and then we can either choose the sum or the average of one of the columns that contains quantitative information. So I'm going to come down and choose annual sales, and I'm going to look at the average of that. So what percentile groups will do is they can break your territories up into a number of groups and color each one of those groups specifically. So for example, if you choose two, you would obviously have the upper 50% one color and the lower 50% another color. Four would do the top 25 one, the following 25 another color, so on and so forth. So what we're going to do is we'll choose four percentile groups, then we can choose the gradient here, and then we can choose whether to add a legend, and then include the data set name and the way that the territories are being colored. So we'll keep all those checked as well, and then we'll click OK. And boom, we've got a custom colored heat map of all of our territories in seconds. So as you can see, all the territories that are appearing is red, so Washington, Oregon, Idaho, Colorado, and others, all have an average annual sales between 33.4 and 49.7 million. And that's how easy it is to create a heat map using territories in MapLine.